All right, guys, let's get game two going. We have got the person who did not come out on top in the Cloak Banshee War last game from the Team Slayers. It is MMA. And up at the top of the map, in the blue color, we have our other Terran player from the Team Prime.we showing superior control last game. But can he beat MMA on a map of MMA's choice? It is Marine King Prime. So TVT, a continuously changing matchup. Yep. This matchup doesn't stay and the same for more than like a couple weeks at a time. <laughs> like, yeah, Marine okay. King, uh, we've mentioned this before, I believe, but uh, I mean, he's he's been playing a little bit inconsistent, I would say, the last month or two. And we've kind of talked about that in his casts in Code A and his casts in the up and down matches and here at the Arena Legends. But lately, he's kind of been pulling it back together. He actually did get out of the up and down matches, barely. But, you know, he... Uh, did pretty well in the Arena of Legends last week. He also he yeah. plays. People say he plays better online. Well, people this, say this he's unbeatable an, online. That's, yeah, that's what everyone says. Yeah, and he, he went. He did really well last week. And so since this is an online tournament, uh, you know, he may be in more of a comfortable place, and it may be just easier in general for him to to play these games. So he might have might might be bringing his A game here. So normally I would say MMA definitely had the advantage, but. Um, as we saw last game, Marine King is not going to go down without a fight. Yeah, absolutely. Well, gas first for Marine King. So he is planning on doing some teching early on. So we'll have to see what he has planned with that. MMA with a pretty normal opening, getting his barracks before the command center. And there's Marine King's... Oh, it is a proxy factory. Now, this could mean a couple of different things. Most likely, it's going to be Banshees, but... Marine King has been one of those Terrans that's done Thor rushes a couple times in the past here, so hmm. I'll have to see what he has planned for that. Um, the, you'd have to walk the Thor all the, all the way around, I yeah, guess. But. Yeah, exactly. Oh, they're say, both proxy factoring each oh other. Oh, my gosh. Seriously? All right, so this is probably <laughs> going to be... Um, I mean, chances are it's probably going to be Banshees, right, guys? But if it is a double proxy Thor rush, I'm going to be so well, happy. Well, I, I don't think Marine King is going to Thor rush. He's his uh, factory is not in a very good position for no, that. No, it's not. So, Just wishful thinking on my part. I mean, MMA, though, his his factory is in a better spot for it, yeah. um, for doing a Thor rush, so that's, a, I guess, a possibility. Oh, but, yeah, we do starport. see the starport for Marine King, not surprising. Yeah. He could be just making a medevac to pick up the Thor and drop it to base. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe I, uh, he is. Probably no, not. No, we're, we're certainly right. going to see Banshees out of Marine King. MMA yeah. is building the armory. Oh, it is going to be a Thor rush from MMA. I wow. love it. Wow. Using one of Marine King's builds against him. Because Marine King's really the only Terran that we've seen Thor rush in the GSL. He's done it a couple times to MVP, actually. This is just, this is going to be really interesting. And it yeah. is going to come down to, I mean, basically, in a way, it's going to come down to if MMA can break Marine King fast enough with the Thor, because if not, if he's somehow able to defend off that Thor, the Banshee will give him such a good economic lead that well, it won't really matter, but he's busting in with this Hellion uh, already. Yeah, MMA trying to soften his opponent up a little bit. Might get an SCV killer, too. Oh, oh get some really good shots Hellion. off with that Hellion. Yeah, wow, all those SCVs are very low. They keep oh. lining up. Oh, man. All right, so two workers killed there by MMA. Did soften up quite a few units. The Thor is on the way. It is almost here. And you know what? With the Banshees that Marine King has, um, MMA could conceivably make a second Thor, too, and send that back to his base to defend. Thors, of course, do quite well against light air units. So if he doesn't have enough Marines, you know, maybe that could work out as well. Yeah. Otherwise, does. he's way out of position. Uh, oh, but there's the engineering bay. Never mind. He's going to be just fine gonna make some turrets yeah the banshee is on the way already it's uh arrived in mma's base actually starting to kill some scvs in mma's base oh really down at the bottom in mma's base at the base of the yellow terran yep there's down the thor at, down at well there's a banshee there we go things. all there right go. yeah all right found it now banshee with eight kills on it already and this is who cares he, he thors just, are more interesting he just didn't have anything and he's actually sending all of his scvs to come into the Thor. Yeah, he didn't have time to make a turret, He's gonna so just he is mass all repair. in. That is actually really interesting. Yeah. Uh, he is definitely going to be all in here because he's not mining at all anymore. Marine King has lost a depot, though, so he's supply yeah. blocked. 
Well, all MMA really needs to do is lift off that command center for now and then drop it again when he needs to scan. Here oh. we go, though. SCVs versus Thor. I mean, they can get the surround possibly, but look at that. He's going to block the oh, ramp with the Thor. Nice. He needs oh, SCVs to repair, though. He's going to lose the Thor. Oh, the uh oh the SCVs are going down quickly, but he kills the Thor. The Marines in the back are doing a ton of damage. The SCVs of yeah. MMA had not arrived on the scene yet, so they were not able to protect the Thor, and he was actually able to target it down with a surround GG. and MMA GG's. That did not work out very well at all for MMA, unfortunately. Um... Wow. So, like, Thor rushes are fun to watch, but they just don't work out very often. Well, like I said, it came down to um, if he was able to fend off the Thor, he was going to win. If he was not able to, he was just it was just going to get broken and lose. But uh, didn't quite pull that rush off, and so wasn't able to defend that Thor, which was the crux of his whole strategy. That's the way it happened. I'm really I'm a little bit surprised that he didn't try and build it a turret and you know try and defend his main at the same time actually i guess at this at that point his injury was well, a little bit late so yeah he tried he would have lost all of his scs in the process he did it as fast as he could really but yeah just couldn't get that turret up yeah yep so mma is up two to oh no he's not he's down I'm, I'm down two to oh uh, sorry ring king is up two oh is what i meant to say yep and i i believe that actually may be it for, uh, for semi-final i've it's a best no, it's of five. A best Never of mind. Five. Yeah. Semi-final. I don't know. Maybe MMA wishes that wishes that was the case after those first two games. <laughs> well, he's going to want a chance to come back here in game number three. He has picked Taldrium Altar, so instead opting for a larger map, and I, I think we saw why he picked Crossfire for for that last well, map. Yeah, he, he had that Thor Rush strategy in mind. But he's picked Taldrium Altar. He's going to go for a more of a macro-oriented game, and I think MMA... Uh, probably does have the better macro of the two. Um, again, ranking, you could just never underestimate him, though. He just can pull all kinds of tricks out of his hat at any time. Well, I mean, MMA has been trying some kind of, well, tried obviously something very risky last game, but he's been playing in a, a style that I feel is kind of outside of his element. I mean, we don't usually see MMA go Banshees very often, and we certainly don't see him Thorush very often. So, I don't know. Kind of seems like he's trying some new stuff. Which is okay. That's cool. Yeah. Um, so we are going to get started here in just a minute, I believe. Yes, we are. MMA has <clears throat> a lot of digging to do to dig himself out of this yeah. gap that he's dug himself into already. I guess maybe digging wouldn't help. Maybe well fill it back in or something like that. But we're going to find out if he can here on Taldrium Altar at the Arena of Legends. <laughs> 